Happy Christmas! I like presents. Oh! Hi, I'm Molly from Mothers Always Right. Hi, I'm Elsa from California Mum in London. I'm Donna and I write the London Mum. Lidl and Mumsnet have asked us to share what's on our festive shopping list in the run-up to Christmas. These are all the things that I've gotten for breakfast, lunch and dinner on Christmas Day. Lidl have got a really good selection actually in this year, whether it's fresh food, frozen foods or your amazing desserts. So we have a turkey crown, which is cooked from frozen. It's all prepared, I don't need to do the stuffing, I don't even need to put streaky bacon on top. I literally just put it in the oven. This year, we are gonna go veggie. Mushroom brie in cranberry wellington. Smoked salmon, very Christmassy, everyone loves smoked salmon. Lots of Prosecco, cause mummy likes Prosecco. A non-alcoholic mulled punch. This lovely champagne, which was only 9.99. Can't have Christmas without your Christmas pudding. This one, is infused with champagne and slow gin. Lieberkuchen, and I love Lieberkuchen just because I love saying Lieberkuchen. There's two gingerbread men in here, and it comes with everything that you need to kind of decorate the gingerbread man, so that's exciting, and hopefully that'll keep him occupied on Christmas morning. So all of this came to 69 pounds and 38 pence. 66 pounds and 55 pence. So 65 pounds is what I spent. Which I think is pretty impressive. So for Christmas Day breakfast, we are going to have smoked salmon on some lovely brown bread with um, scrambled eggs. What do you have there for breakfast? Does that look yummy? Yeah. That's all yummy. By the time it's Christmas lunch, I am usually starving. So instead of having a very small breakfast, I decided to have a big breakfast that we could all enjoy and we could all eat together. So the table's all set, everything's served. My mouth is properly watering now, look at this. We're just gonna open some champagne and then we're gonna yeah, eat. Yay. Turkey is so good, it's really moist and yeah. both girls have had second portions. The veggie wellingtons look so yummy. We're also having them with some roasted parsnips, some garlic mashed potato. So come Christmas, obviously you don't want any of your guests to go hungry. So I always have basically a massive table spread full of food. So we've got the lovely smoked salmon, which comes with its own horseradish sauce, which I've kind of layered down the sides there. So lots of fresh goodies, lots of naughty treats. We've got the, the panettone bread at the end there. Oh, look at that, that looks so good. Is it yummy, yummy? Yeah. We have fed four adults, two children, all of us have had at least two portions, some of us have had three. We've still got all of this turkey left over. That whole turkey crown cost us 12 99 For pudding, a lovely nine month matured Christmas pudding. Is it as good as mum's? Mum. Oh, that's a dangerous pudding. <laughs> yes. You excited? <laughs> Mm. It. Really? Yeah. I think it's time for me to have some, right? We don't really fancy having a really big meal in the evening, so what I do is I just lay out, you know, cheeses and bits that people can pick at, maybe a few mince pies. The party food was such a winner. It was wonderful just to have lots of things on the table. So it's been a really brilliant day. We've eaten loads. Been stuffing ourselves silly, to be honest, but in a good way. Last year, our shop was about 130 pounds. 90 pounds. Maybe 300 pounds. So we've saved a fair whack of money, and I don't feel like there isn't anything that we haven't got. I was really impressed by price. I was really impressed by quality. I would definitely recommend you think about doing your Christmas food shop at Lidl this year. You can get so much for your money, and you don't have to compromise on quality. So I hope you enjoyed spending the day with us got any comments post them below and don't forget to subscribe say thank you little thank you little